Well, you're taking a live look over our Allo Communications camera. We have mostly clear skies, although uh, some high clouds are trying to work their way into the picture here. We'll keep some clouds in the forecast for the overnight hours. Uh, first, I want to talk about where we started off as far as temperatures went this morning. 10 degrees. That was the low this morning. Most starting out in the teens, but boy, temperatures sure did warm up for the afternoon, making it up 2 degrees shy of 60 degrees here in Lincoln. Our high 58 degrees. Now, we are cooler at this hour in the upper 40s in many locations. 47 right now in Lincoln, 48 degrees in Wahoo, 46 in Beatrice, 48 in York, uh, 50 degrees in Hastings. Got one stubborn location still hanging on to the 50s. Uh, 48 degrees the current temperature in Grand Island. For tonight, we're looking at lows a little bit warmer compared to this morning. We're looking at lows in the low to mid 20s. It's a warmer night, uh, a few clouds, winds out of the southwest initially, but eventually shifting out of the northwest should be on the lighter side, three to eight miles per hour. Let's pick up Stormcast this evening. Here are those clouds that we saw over the Allo Communications camera. We're keeping them throughout much of the overnight hours, but you'll notice there are plenty of gaps here and there, so we'll go mostly clear to partly cloudy, and I'd argue uh, that most periods will be on the mostly clear side of things. Then our attention is going to turn to northern Nebraska as you go in towards Sunday morning. See a couple of these here? Uh, yeah, we may have a couple flurries trying to work their way off towards the south, maybe approaching Columbus or maybe areas uh, just north of Grand Island. I have a hard time thinking these are going to be able to survive into southern Nebraska. I don't think many are going to see flurries at all. So we're keeping the forecast dry for your Sunday. Some low clouds for the afternoon uh, before we eventually start to clear out tomorrow evening. Now, while we will be mostly clear on Sunday evening, there will be another wave of cloudiness that we are watching. That will arrive in the overnight hours. Should be with us on Monday morning, but even this batch of cloudiness should depart by the time we get to Monday afternoon. We are forecasting sunny skies for the afternoon hours on Monday. So it should be cooler for your Sunday temperatures in the 40s as opposed to the 50s, and it should be breezy for the afternoon as well. Winds out of the north northwest 10 to 20 miles per hour with a few gusts upwards of 30 miles per hour. Now it is no secret. It has been a very, very dry winter. This is the snowfall across three locations since September 1st in Lincoln. We've only had 3.7 inches of snowfall so far, a little bit more in Grand Island, just above five inches and just shy of eight inches out towards Omaha. But this is well below what we would normally expect by this time in winter. Now, as far as the drought goes right now, uh, see this yellow zone right here? This is what we call abnormally dry conditions, and it's trying to get closer and closer to eastern Nebraska here. In fact, some of the Tri-Cities are in a moderate drought right now, but the worst of it looks like it's off in western Nebraska, where we have severe droughts posted in the southwest corner of the state, even out towards the Panhandle. When it's all said and done, 91% of the state of Nebraska is either abnormally dry, that's this yellow region, or within a drought, a step above uh, abnormally dry. Dry. So uh, it'll be interesting to see if we can get more precipitation in the months to come. But in the meantime, it's going to be very warm, very dry. We got a 60 to 70 percent chance of seeing above normal temperatures for the latter portion of the 10 day outlook. I like to think of that as a 60 to 70 percent chance of uh, seeing of paying less in heating costs. Same goes for precipitation as well. Good chance of seeing below normal precipitation as well. We can see that on our 10 day outlook. It's mostly dry. Plenty of breezy days on there. Uh, we're introducing the chance for maybe a morning flurry on. On Thursday, but uh, yeah, it is just very, very warm throughout much of the 10 day outlook. Plenty of days above 50 degrees, Macy. So uh, yeah, make sure to get outside and enjoy those days because uh, yeah, as we know, it can turn cooler at any point in time in winter.